So we're going to have to kind of going to have to replace this um, pool pump housing um, gasket. This uh, actually this pool this actually motor this motor's impeller and the diffuser. As you can see, there's no diffuser gasket in there. We should have brought one with us here in the pool. So we're not going to replace it. So it's always best to turn it off. Everything just to be safe. You know, the pump can actually turn on while you're doing this process. It can, the, if you want to stick your hand, it probably can swim. It can cut your finger off almost. And then here we go, you got the inside of the motor, you got the front bearing here. So I say the shaft. Front shaft. You got your motor windings right in here. You got your two fans. I'm gonna flick it on real quick. Be careful you don't want it to get on your foot. And that's why we have a we pull switch off. Come back, turn it off. Sounds normal once it's. You can hear the impeller actually starting to be scraping off. So we're gonna go ahead and get our. This is an Allen head. Let's see if we got an Allen head screw. Right in here we do. And I like, uh, it's always best to find the, the right one, which is I have it on the outside. Take this off. I'm saying this is a on head screw. You can use a channel locks too, it doesn't matter. Or pliers. It doesn't have to be an Allen head, but it just keeps to keep the diffuser on. So when you take it off it doesn't break or off or anything. Right. About to take it off here. Put that to the side. And here's your impeller. Let's try getting your gunk out, some hair, some leaves. We almost have to take the impeller out. So we're gonna go ahead and put it on its belly here. Here's a shaft, and you have to get it one of these uh, tools right here you have to stick it on the shaft to hold it down so so this is gonna go once you're doing this there's a screw and it's reversed righty lefty lefty righty or tidy that's reversed. So, so we're gonna go ahead and turn it, this, this to the right. Make sure you hold the the motor to your legs once you're taking the screw out. Now I always have to use the extra set of hands. I'm gonna go ahead and put the camera down a little bit. Okay, put that with your tools, 
you see I got the screw off the impella. Then you're gonna go ahead and get your one and a half. I don't know what these things are called here, but the you know you just wear this thing. Put it on its belly. Always wanna put them on its belly. That's why I don't know why I call it a belly, it's because I like to. Okay. If it doesn't come off, try using a 16th channel lock. Uh, so you can see that tool came off. You don't want it to come off during this. Alright, so it's gonna go to the left. The impeller goes to the left, but the screw goes to the right. Probably have to stop this one real quick until I get it 